Following the historic six-year pause on any new federal regulations, the lobster industry is potentially shifting to a new type of management to help lobster men and women keep doing what they do best. This management style is known as dynamic management. It's a management tool that would allow us to monitor the presence for the presence of whales within the Gulf of Maine, and we would monitor their presence by using uh, acoustic, acoustical listening devices as well as um, uh, flyovers with planes. Dynamic management has been considered before, and a version of this is being used in parts of the United States and Canada. With the six-year pause successfully passing an omnibus spending bill, many fishermen are excited about the opportunity to try out dynamic management and gauge its benefits. You know, the fishermen are on board with that. Um, I don't think any fisherman is against the fact that we want to be able to do some sort of regulatory action that actually, you know, protects a right whale, protects them where they are. By having dynamic, uh, dynamic management, you're able to fish the area without being forced out of it unless there's a whale in the area. Based on what Commissioner Kelleher has seen, he believes dynamic management would help propel the lobster industry forward in its fight against restrictions they say endangering the fishery's future. There's a lot of conversation that needs to happen. We're at the very early stages of discussing dynamic management, um, but it's something that, uh, that, that we feel is a very viable tool, and I think we'll be able to show that as we collect more data. In Bass Harbor, Matthew Jurancic reporting for ABC7 and Fox 22 News.